I feel like Vitafly gonna recap this and say God he caught a 30 on the dime roll. So all y'all wanna know what happened, I'm gonna tell you what happened. He got smoked. That one was crazy out of the game. Sometimes that's Peter, nobody that knows body. Hit his area with 51. Everything in the Vitafly. We used to rapping like that. You already know what it is, man. Salute to the subscribers. That notification gang got my dog with me. Showtime SP. Nobody that knows bodies. Okay, so Jada Nightwing and John John and Don have been going back and forth, right? If you've, you know, you've, I know you've seen the blogs. Yeah. Uh, I've been keeping track of this. I've been, it's like tennis. Like one does a blog, the next one does a blog. I've been doing blog for blog for blog for blog. So now Jada Nightwing has came back with a series of joints, basically saying why he wants to battle John John and Don. Mm. I personally said that I think John John is the fastest way to an early retirement. Yes. Jada Nightwing says, go ahead, let him retire me, this is what I want. He wants to smoke. Uh, he wants to smoke, he right? He, he, he said all, he dropped all his blogs. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna put those at the end mm -hmm. because gotta, I gotta be diplomatic about this. If right. one person says something, gotta put theirs out. Yeah. The next person says theirs, put theirs out. Two so, what do you think? Man, listen. All right. Um, I, 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 I absolutely uh, think Jada Nightwing is fire. Mm -hmm. Um, and after that performance versus Shotgun Shug that I still haven't seen, we supposed to have abs for that. You slack it on the abs for that. Mm -hmm. Um, so I mean, when when it once it finally drops, I get to see actually what went down. But. Um, for Jaded Nightwing, he is on a fast train. He is that avalanche, and the right. snowball is just turning into a big old avalanche. Great. Thing about it is, John John is that big body of water that when the snow hits that water, nothing happens. It's no, just no. Uh, it's, it's gone. There's no more avalanche, and it's not that. I don't think Jaden Nightwing has a shot because I do believe that Jaden Nightwing has a shot. Right. Everybody has a shot against John John. It's just that when John John is is around and it's it's when you're in front of him like it's it's different it is way different you know right. what I'm saying people can poke holes in John John's uh, in his bars and all of his schemes maybe he's not relatable mm -hmm. maybe he just sounds like he's just reading stuff like that but for some reason John John keeps smoking these niggas right. and it's and it's not just niggas it's the people who you consider the killers and they're the youngest and they coming up. Once, if you are considered a rookie or mm -hmm. somebody that is deserving of a shot and you go against John John the Dime, it does not end well for you. Right. This battle might be able to change the narrative. Okay. This Because of the fact that I think they both honestly respect each other too. Okay. You know what I'm saying? It's a respect level. I honestly think that this battle should happen. Should it be a rookies versus vets battle? No, because he already did, you know, his, he played his part. It should just be a summer badness battle. No. Mm. I honestly feel as though this could be, you know, the potential, but let that, I think it should, I think that's what needs to build a little bit more. Right, right, Jay right. got to build a little bit more of a resume. I'm saying know. fuck it, let him do it. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> I'm like that. That's how I'm looking at it. Listen, I'm listening to his blogs. I'm listening to what he's saying online. I'm listening to what he's, what he's, what he's going back and forth about. If he feels that confident, let it happen. I've seen this. I've been down this road before. We've been here long enough to see these battles happen. It's like once a year. It's like annually a nigga would think they could beat John John, and then, you know, what happens, happens. Right. Now, I do think, like I said earlier, I think J.J. Nightwing's talented. Very. You know what I'm saying? But John John the Don, I just feel like, has a way of going about handling his business. And, you know, but J.J. Nightwing clearly does not respect that. He's, he's spoken his piece in his blogs, which I'm going to put at the end of this. Mm -hmm. um, so, it's something that you want to see. I mean, at the end of the day, hell yeah, I definitely want to see it. If it's anything anything involving a rookie versus John John or anything, somebody of a lower tier that deserves a shot at John John, I'm always going to root for that battle. But I already know the outcome of this. You know what I'm saying? I, but I don't think John John can ruin Jaden Nightwing's career because Jaden Nightwing doesn't seem like the cat that's going to take a slouch. It's just he has that He's only had a few battles. That tournament stretched him out. Mm -hmm. But remember, there was a stigma that he had. So let's just not get into that. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? Like, that's why I feel like maybe one or two more battles from Jay, and I'm more confident that he can go up against John John right. and be a reputable opponent. Okay. And I seen somebody put a list out of names. They were like, uh, Mr. Wavy, Ryder, uh, Mr. Wavy, Ryder, and you know, a couple other names like Young Cannon and things like that. And saying, like, give him all five of these battles. If he does uh, have his winning record after five, 
then we're like, okay. I mean, he wants take, it now, though. I take three. That's what I'm saying. Three for five is a little too much because, like, it's not a. Um, but line three up, like, wavy. Line, yeah. Ride up. If you get. Uh, low source. Everything like that. that's an attribute of job. Like, I don't want it to be sound like a tournament, but if that's what it sounds like, he would be going through again. So why is it that Jay tonight when he has to go through another tournament? This time he has to win, though. Right. He got to be triumphant at the end. And the ending trope, and then the ending. Result is that you get this shot and that you have now earned that stage I think if they do line it up like that he automatically jumps up to mid tier right you know what I'm saying like this it these can only catapult you Well, let's get into his live and see what he says. You already know what to do and what it does. So you gotta ask what it was <laughs> Second round was my best round. Maybe he takes the third. Maybe I still beat him I still beat him we can go back and forth as to whether, you know, it would have been different, but I still beat him. I beat him. I'm the lux of my class. I mean, it's rookies versus vets season. How does it how does it not make sense? How does it not make sense? I think you're lying to yourself. And I think the the biggest misunderstanding was that you thought I thought I rank with you now because I beat Shotgun Shook. No. It's the season. As soon as the season's over, I'll go back to battling uh, easy to block captain. Maybe I'll back. Maybe I'll battle drugs, or we'll see. There's a whole lot of matches that. Hey, baby. There's a whole lot of matches that gotta happen. So, come on, man. It's cold outside, bro. You coming outside or not? That's all I need to know. Get your money though, because I remember hearing that in your podcast too. Get your money. Because they don't give you the money, man. Like, I already know, like, you're about to be hot about that. And, yeah. So, definitely get your money. But here's my advice. Do not take the battle if you're not going to take it 100% seriously. Because you're right. You do got more to lose. Mm. See, here's the thing. I guess you do. I guess you do got more to lose. But see, my fall's harder. You understand that? It isn't necessarily that I got nothing to lose. I mean, you're the guy that ends careers, right? So I lose to John John. That might be it. Your career is not on the line whatsoever. There's nothing like... I mean, I didn't sleep with your girlfriend or nothing like... So there, there's no, there's none of that that you gotta worry about. But that, I mean, it is subjective, but it's not subjective. It's not. It's kind of not. And you, okay. I think you might have questioned why you, right? Because you're that guy. I mean, if you're in my position, right, and you're the rookie. And it's rookies versus vets season, right? Who the fuck else are you going to go after? What nigga can make you undeniable but the nigga that everyone says kills niggas like you? Or like me? Yeah. If you're a rookie and you wanted to be undeniable, would you not kill the nigga that is renowned for killing rookies? And then, you, and then, you, and then you can say, "Oh, didn't you see what I did to Mister Wavy? Didn't you see what I did to Prep? Didn't you see what I did to Jack Boy?" Yeah, I seen it. You're pretty dangerous. I'm pretty dangerous too. Did you not see what I did to the vet that tried to? Come on, caffeine, where I got the most experience. I kind of fucked with him. Oh, you beat a bad shug. Okay. Yeah, I beat a bad shug. Does that mean I won by default? I don't think so, sir. He just got me, got me taking it 30. He didn't fuck up in the first round. He just got me taking it. You don't, but, I mean, you clearly... I ain't going to just outright say you biased, but... You clearly have reason to 
show you that. That's neither here nor there. A lot of people, general populace, majority, feel that even if Shug got his rounds out, I still whooped his ass. Mad King t-shirt, you know what I'm saying? Get yourself a uh, fucking support your fellow battle rap, your favorite battle rapper, the Mad King. Relax. Relax. We gonna talk. We gonna talk, man. We gotta talk. I don't know if you shout out John John, first of all. Shout out John John to Don. Shout out all the above is podcasts that you can listen to on Spotify. Go check out all those episodes. Matter of fact, go check out that episode, his most recent one, or if it still is his most recent one. Go check out that uh that uh that uh message to Jay the Nightwing. Cause if you don't check that out, this ain't really gonna make sense. You gotta listen to that first, then come back and listen to this one. And listen to all the other episodes, because they all pretty fire. Alright. Johnny, 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 y'all seen the title. This response. I think I think I think we got a misunderstanding, sir. I think the way you took what my call out for you is that. I'm under the impression that I'm on your level. Like, I rank with you now because I beat Shotgun Shug. No. Like, I don't I don't think I'm on your level, sir. I clearly am aware that your accolades are, and, and, uh, and your catalog is far more defined, sir. But tis the season. Tis the season. It's rookies versus vets season. Is it not? Aren't I a rookie? Art thou a vet? How does it not make sense? I don't get it. How does it not make sense? Is it because I, I can understand if like you feel like maybe you should be the one battling the best rookie. Like maybe Fonz is the one you should be battling. Okay. I mean, the way I see this class, though, if I was to have to do like a, an analogy... I would see Fonz as like the mook, you know what I'm saying? Like he's the one who beat everybody, in a sense. I'm clearly the Lux of my class. I'm clearly that nigga. You can definitely take some damage. Your reputation definitely is at stake. But you beat Jay the Nightwing? It's probably the last time any rookie on my level comes after you ever again. Because the 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 effort that you would have to put in to beat me in that setting this season. Yeah. We'd have to see a John John we ain't seen before, bro. That little cause let's not let's let, let's face it, bro. Like you be getting away with a lot of corn and shit. Like you be you be getting away with some white shit. And that's cause like, you know, crowds packed, everyone's drunk, like niggas is uh, bro. Nigga, you threw Jack Boy's chain in the crowd. It wasn't even Jack Boy's chain. It wasn't even the chain he was wearing. When I heard about the hype for that shit, I thought you snatched his chain off of his fucking neck and then threw that shit. Nigga, you pulled up. You bought a chain. And then you threw that. Nigga, you just threw your own money out there. Wasn't it $80? You threw $80 in the crap that you paid for. What the fuck did you... And niggas reacted for that. What kind of dumb shit was that? You, you, you went... And then you said, like, the... You said, you got, you didn't get this from Walmart. Like, that helps. Crowd reaction. Minute long crowd reaction. Shame. Bro. Bro. You had a, you had a scheme about, like, taking your glasses off, doing this, and. What? What? What the fuck? What? No, no, that's not, that's not going to work. It's not going to work, sir. Like, you got to rap. I've been rapping. You don't really rap like that. So, so, so you can jump down off the high horse a little bit. You know what I'm saying? That horse ain't, that horse ain't really high anymore, man. Not here. Maybe when the crowds come back. But during this COVID season. Yeah, man. 
fifth, 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 bitch, I'm about my cheese, but on the beat, high kill Chucky, you think your bitch clean, ain't got no bag, so she still ugly, got her off the mud, with my thugs, working real ugly, my old bitch got a nigga, won't stop calling, that bitch still love me, new bitch way bad, she act bad, she'll kill for me, push up off that yard, dick in her stomach, do it feel lovely, bitch, you say you real, will suck this dick, and sell these pills for me, murder for the free, but pay the fee, it could get real ugly, can't do shit for free, need compensation, for my conversation, heard the suckers hating, tell them stop it, that's abomination, creep down your block, we're basing, dreads mad so they think I'm Haitian, ain't no hesitation, I see a sucker, but I got a banker, niggas know for faking, I'm known for taking shots without me thinking, oops, I made me thinking, my bitch crazy, always think I'm creeping, oops, I made me creeping, it's blood gang, I bang it every season, fuck what's niggas thinking, trying to count me out while I'm still breathing, niggas know who my team is, this bitch crazy, all she eat is see me, they say I'm a demon, I stand tall like the Pledge of Allegiance, leave a nigga stinking, brain hanging out, you see what he thinking, just give me a reason, I'ma show you all my niggas tweaking, oh, I heard